Hi, I'm Terry Williams. I'm a AJA Video Systems Field Service Engineer, and I'm here today to show you how to properly install a Kona 3 in a system that will be used for smoke on the Mac. AJA and Autodesk have enjoyed a long relationship. For the better part of a decade, Autodesk's Flame, Luster, and Smoke Advanced Products have incorporated AJA's OEM Capture, Display, and Mastering I.O. cards in a turnkey environment. The 10-bit 2K output capabilities of these cards have allowed mastering to the highest standards. Now with Smoke on the Mac, a user can purchase a commercially available AJA Kona 3 card and along with Autodesk's Smoke on the Mac software and a correctly configured Mac Pro, produce creative finishing results for their projects at the highest caliber. To get started, we first have to open our Mac Pro. The first thing you'll want to do is make sure you've disconnected the power cord. I like to unplug both ends of the power cord before moving forward. It might also be easier to work with the machine if other attached cables are disconnected before we tilt the machine on its side to open it up. On the back of the Mac Pro, you'll see this lever. When you pull the lever, you'll release the latch for the side panel of the computer, and you'll be able to remove the panel and set it aside. Looking at the inside of the computer toward the back panel, you'll see a small plate with two thumb screws on it. This plate holds installed cards in place. You should be able to loosen the thumb screws on this plate by hand, but if they're too tight, you can loosen them using a number two Phillips head screwdriver. The screws are attached to the plate so that they won't get lost. Once you've loosened them enough, you should be able to lift the plate out and set it aside. Now we can slide the Kona 3 card into its slot. Use great care during this step. Don't force anything that feels like it might not be fitting properly. Instead, look carefully to see that you have the slot and the card lined up correctly. Once you've got the card firmly in its slot, you can replace the plate that will hold it in place and tighten down the thumb screws. After the plate is back in place, the side panel can be put back on and secured by pushing the lever back into its original position. Reconnect the necessary cables, then the power cord. Finally, Set your Mac Pro back upright. When your computer is up and running, you'll need to make sure that the account you're using has administrative privileges before you install anything. This is true for the AJA drivers and software, as well as Autodesk's Smoke. Once we know that we are an administrative user, we can download and install the AJA drivers and software. From the AJA website, Download the most recent driver package for the Kona 3. We're now going to run the package and follow its on-screen instructions. And that's it. When your computer starts, the Kona 3 should be good to go. You'll be ready to install Smoke. And for that, I'll turn things over to Barry Gosh.